Mahal na bike, cheap na helmet. Pakibo! Hi! Welcome back! Ah, recently, meron na naman akong mga nababasa na minsan ewan ko kung dapat kong kainisan o hindi and because you see a lot of these vloggers na naka ang gaganda ng motorcycle uh, we're talking about motorcycles in the 1 million range tapos pag tinitingnan mo um, I think someone posted na ang helmet na gamit nila are, are the local branded ones so bigla na lang may magpo-post ganda-ganda ng motor pero ang, ang helmet tigpa 4,000 lang tigpa 5,000 lang wow, ang nakakainis dito is 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 people seem to 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 be brand snobs pagdating sa sa ganun um, this is from a group of uh, users who are uh, using a, a slightly a, a more expensive brand of imported helmet no? so so feeling nila malamang na dahil mas mahal yung helmet nila mas nakakaangat sila pero people have choices anong, anong kinalaman ng choice ng isang taong naka 1 million na BMW sa choice ng helmet niya sa'yo bakit kailangan mong gawa ng issue na na wala silang pakilam sa safety may pambili ng motor walang pambili ng helmet ano ba ikakasama sa inyo nun? I don't, I don't really see the whole point of, of trying to put people down when there's nothing wrong with their choice of helmet a lot of this uh, more affordable we're not talking about your super cheap the more affordable helmets that are uh, brands that are only available in the Philippines a lot of them are properly certified meaning they have the whole DOT ECE rating which means they if if they want to sell in the US or in Europe their helmet will pass the standards meaning it's the same standards that the person who probably own that more expensive American brand have the have the same standards meaning they are pretty much going to be as safe now I don't own one of those helmets, not because of the brand. Uh, my, 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 my reasoning why I don't own one of those helmets is, for what I have never found a design that suits me. The design that I, I, I buy based on design, it's a helmet. Of course, there's minimum safety involved. And then, of course, I want the higher spec ones, meaning, mas gusto ko yung mas magaan. May option ng ganito, may option sa ganito. So, so that's why, that those are my choices. But brand is not necessarily uh, very, very important. As long as it meets the ratings that I need. Tsaka it meets the, what I need out of the helmet. Like the bell uh, eliminator I'm using here. One of the reasons I bought it is for what I really like the look. I like the color. And it's very, very light. So, it, it, it checks a lot of what I need. So, I did choose it because it was a bell. Because when I was shopping for a helmet, uh, I was considering a lot of brands, not just bell. Hindi yan yung, oh, kung ko bell kasi sikat si bell. Hindi. I don't really care about, about specific brands as long as it meets my criteria that I need it to be. Pero bakit, bakit mayroong mga tao na mas maganda yung helmet nila? Kailangan nila siraan yung trip ng ibang mas, ma, mas, mas mura yung helmet. Ano kinalaman ng helmet na yun sa kanila? Minsan, minsan talaga, yun ang, minsan ang maiinis ka eh. Diba? Parang, they're going to try to laugh about it is to make, make them feel better. Kasi mas maganda helmet mo. Wala naman silang maling ginagawa. Wala naman silang illegal na ginagawa. Dimbo trip? O problema mo yun. Hindi nila problema yun. So, guys. 
your brand has alam mo, minsan yung mga ganyan brand brand, alam mo pagdating sa dulo, isa lang factory niyan sa China tinatakan lang ng iba-ibang brand, yung kala mong brand na ginagamit mo na mas mahal, baka iisa lang gumagawa niyan sa China binabago lang yung brand so I hope it's just a matter of respect respetuhin mo yung decision nila they'll respect your decision bakit? even if you own a 10-15,000 helmet bakit? Pinag, pinagtatawa ng kaba nung nakakabili ng mga 50,000 na helmet so medyo ano lang uh, respeto wala naman, wala naman ikasasama eh wala naman iibubuti sa buhay mo kung marunong lang tayo rin respeto ng iba respect their decision uminit pa ulo mo para sa, para sa wala I'm, I'm really I'm really happy we now have all these local brands that have met the European the American standards of what of a safety rating when we when I started riding uh, 20 years ago the affordable helmets that we were using na nagpapasalamat kami meron was something like HJC but it wasn't still as as affordable to what they are being offered now we are now being uh, a lot of the riders who, who can't even afford the HJC now have options for all these mga local brand that are meeting the same standards at a more affordable price. Diba? Hindi ba better yan for everyone? Hindi ba better yan for the riders now that they have that option? So, so sa, ano, we should be we should be celebrating the option of having uh, an affordable high quality helmets kesa naman binabash pa natin kasi bakit ang mumura ng helmet nila ang mahal mahal ng motor imbis na gano'n so what's important is uh, kung para sa'yo it's not good enough then, then buy something else it's not going to affect their choice of helmet has nothing to do with you. That's their personal choice. So thank you. Another rant. <laughs> Another vlog. See you guys again soon. Bye.